Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be channeling for May 2024, see what the vibe is of your month. This video is for Gemini. If you are a Gemini, keep on watching. This message is for you. So we're going to start by seeing what's the overall vibe for the month of May. Um, and then we're going to use some oracle to see what's coming forward in love for you. Hi, Louie. What's up? <laughs> we got a visitor here, Gemini. All right. What's coming forward for Gemini? May 2024. Oh. Gemini. We have a tower moment, love. <laughs> Um, I don't think this is necessarily bad, though. What's up, honey? What's the matter? <laughs> uh, we do have the page of presence here. You're distracting me, Lewis. We have the page of presence here, and we also have the seven of candles, okay? This is a card of perseverance. I'm hearing that immediately, okay? So there's something you need to persevere towards, even if this tower moment, like, comes in and like I just feel like this is a lot of stress okay I don't feel like this is anything that's gonna like ruin your life or anything horrible don't let this tower scare you but it's uncomfortable okay it's uncomfortable change it's you having to leave your comfort zone needing to see the truth about a situation and it's just making you uncomfortable Gemini okay <laughs> um but it is gonna help you grow overall seven of candles if you continue to persevere and like go for the things you truly want still um, page of presence energy, page of pentacles, um, does kind of talk of like, things will work out as long as you like keep your cool, Gemini. <laughs> You're like being tasked or tested even in the month of May to see, um, if you can kind of keep your cool under stress. Okay. That, which mostly, which, which usually means Gemini, that there is a reward or a blessing, a manifestation coming through. Okay, or wanting to come through right after this tower moment. He really, he's, I'm like almost done with recording these and this is the first reading he's like here for. <laughs> you like the Gemini's, Lou? What's coming forward in the month of May for Gemini? Oh my gosh. Twin flame! <laughs> Holy crap! Are you in the twin flame journey? Gemini, a spiritual connection between you and your twin flame. You could be meeting your twin flame in the month of May. Holy crap, Gemini. Tower, that could be the unexpected thing. Maybe someone from the past. Maybe you don't even know about the twin flame connection you have with someone from your past. Maybe you're in denial that it's a twin flame. You're unsure that it's a twin flame. You could be getting confirmation that you're in a twin flame connection in the month of May. Maybe reconciliation with them. I don't feel that here. I don't feel celebratory energy. I feel like in the month of May here, this twin flame popping up can complicate things <laughs> for you, Gemini. Um, but there is someone you, you seem to not be able to let go of. Um, you may even try to let go of this person in the month of May and it kind of backfires on you. Um, this doesn't mean don't follow your intuition. It doesn't mean let someone in anyway. Um, but this is some kind of difficulty that you need to go through. Okay, so let things kind of unfold naturally here for you, Gemini. That's what I have for you for the month of May. Um, if you're interested in booking a private month ahead reading, go to highpriestessdivination.com or click the link in my description down below. Thank you so much for watching, Gemini. I'll see you on the next one.